Hello everyone, welcome to the Smart Post Show Pro Plugin video tutorial series. Today I am going to show you how to create a fully featured post slider. Make sure that Smart Post Show Pro Plugin is installed and activated into your site. You can directly click on Add New or you can click Manage Shows and then click Add New to create a new show and give it a title. Below that you'll find several configuration tabs, go to the descriptions configuration tab and set the column value to 1 for all responsive devices. Now click show preview and you can see this is how a post slider looks like initially. You can see the post contents are showing below the post image. This is happening because the content orientation is set as default. To give the slider a better look, let's set the content orientation as overlay and set the content position as bottom. Now update the preview and you can see the contents are showing at the bottom position but they are barely visible since the overlay and the content color almost matched. Don't worry, Smart Posture plugin has the option to change the font properties. Go to the typography and here you will find the option to change the font properties like font family, text alignment, text transformation, font size, line height, font color and etc. I am changing the font color to white. Go to the display options again and set the content padding as you like. Click on the thumbnail and let's set a custom size for the thumbnail to give it a better look. And finally click on content and set the read more color to white. Now the post slider is ready. Publish the short code and go to a page where you want to display it. Insert the short code using the Smart Post Show Pro Gutenberg block. Publish the page and view it. You can see how beautifully the post slider is showing in the web pages. Go back to the shortcut and navigate to the carousel controls. Scroll down a bit to find the option named transition effect. There are 5 transition effects available for the post slider and they are slide, fade, cover flow, cube and flip. You have already seen the slide transition effect. Let's set it to fade, update the shortcut and refresh the page. You can see the posts are moving with a fade in effect. If I set it to cover flow and update the shortcode, refresh the page, then you can see this is how the cover flow transition effect looks like. This is how you can create a beautiful post slider with the Smart Post Show Pro plugin and display it to your web pages. That's all about today. In the next video, I will come up with another attractive feature of the plugin. Until then, take care.